What's going on YouTube? Rabe here and today we're taking a look at Transformers Combiner Wars Rodimus. So now this is the uh, Legends class Rodimus based on the Blackjack mold and um, as you can see it's it looks like Rodimus. I mean they did a, a pretty decent job. <clears throat> the only thing is uh, the obvious lack of the flames on his chest which is kind of one of the iconic things about Rodimus but it's all right, it, you know. We'll, it's 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 a legends figure. We'll we'll just let it let it go at that. Uh, hopefully, we'll get a better Rodimus down the line at some point. Um, but <clears throat> like I said, this is based on the Blackjack mold. You can see right on the back here. We've got a little uh, little bio. Brash Warrior has the makings of a skilled commander and honorable leader, um, or derpy <laughs> derpy weirdo leader. Uh, if you're reading the comic books, but that's okay you know i'm not really i i do hope that they have fixed the connector problem uh on this guy as far as the motormaster slash optimus mold is concerned uh you know as far as becoming a chest piece for optimus maximus uh, but i'm i'm not expecting anything big out of this i like the blackjack mold i think it's a really great figure uh and i'm just i'm expecting this to be pretty much exactly the same just in Rodimus colors. So uh, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get this guy out of the package and I will see you in a moment. All right, guys. So here we have Rodimus in his vehicle mode and um, it's okay looking. It's it's not bad. Uh, I do like the paint used on the, uh, the, the windows of the vehicle. Uh, we've got this... Uh, axe thing again obviously i do kind of wish they'd at least have like remolded this um even if they kept it mostly the same but just stuck like a tab on this side so when it's on his back you could stick it and have like the rodimus wings coming up i think that would have been really amazing and probably not that expensive for them to do but you know it is it is what it is um you can see we've got the flames on the hood there of course and uh one other little gripe i guess i have is i i think this really needs an autobot symbol like really badly uh it's just a big blob of yellow and it really does look i don't know it just looks like a mustard spill without like just something in the middle to kind of break it up so it would have been nice to either have just a little more red in the middle which would have been perfect for an autobot symbol or just something but uh well, then, you know, it, it's all right otherwise. Uh, here it is compared to Blackjack. You can see Blackjack does have a Decepticon symbol in the middle there. And uh, they're both very neat little cars. Uh, he rolls just fine-ish, you know, as well as you can with the little clipped-in wheels. Um, and, yeah, he's all right. So let's transform him to robot mode. You do it by removing that. And uh, basically we're just going to pop the arms out here just swing them around like so I'm gonna pull this up pull the roof of the car up and over and back like so we're gonna bring this down flip the chest down <clears throat> flip the arms forward and just split the legs here and there you have Rodimus in robot mode and again it would have been nice See if you had it like one right here, you could plug it in here, and it would have just like that. And I think that would have looked really, really good, but alas, we do not have that. So you can just stick this in his hand if you so desire. And uh, that'll give him a weapon. Uh, he's got all the articulation you remember from Blackjack. He's got a little bit... It is a ball-jointed head, I think, or it's just a kind of loose-ish... No, it's definitely not a ball joint. Um, it's just a swivel head. I'll give you a quick close-up of his face if I can get it to focus. There you go. Very nice. They actually did paint in his eyes blue, which are, is a very nice touch. Um, he's got ball-jointed shoulders, swivel elbows, hinge elbows, no waist. He's got ball-jointed hips and a ball-jointed knee. And that's it for his articulation. But that is a lot for a legend size figure. Um, and I think it works out pretty well. Let me just go ahead and transform Blackjack really quickly here. And we'll compare those two together. 
whoops, come on, there we go. So you can see, again, the difference. Uh, really, the only remold is the head, which is nice that they did remold the head. And uh, otherwise, the paint, paint applications are completely different, which is expected. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, they're they're both very nice. So let us take a quick look here. He does have an Autobot symbol up here on his shoulder, which is fine. But that's the only one he's got, which again, really nice right there. But all right, <clears throat> so let's take a look here and see because I remember when I had Blackjack uh, combined with Menasaur, super loose, did not want to stay put at all. On the uh, on the tabs that are on uh, Motormaster or Menasaur, didn't want to stay put at all. So let's see if this guy has improved upon that at all, or if it's you know the same exact situation that we're in. So we just want to put him back in vehicle mode and plug his uh, shield slash gun thing slash axe into his roof like so. We're going to grab Menasaur here. I'm going to adjust the camera accordingly. Now, it really doesn't really need to be a perfect angle, but I'm going to go ahead and open this guy up. And let's see here. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Still loose. Still exactly the same problem. Um, What's that? Oh, no! My chest fell out! Oh, that's the worst! Oh, now I'm off balance. <sighs> uh, yeah, so unfortunately they did not bother to fix that pretty definite big deal issue uh, with Menasaur slash, you know, with the Blackjack slash Rodimus mold. That is a, a big... It's a bummer. It's just a bummer. Um, but it is what it is. They have, like, adapters you can buy, although they are out of stock. But um, I know, like, Non-F has made adapters, and hopefully he'll get some more of those made, and I'll be able to, to pick one up and, uh, and hopefully show that off at some point. But in the meantime, yeah, I mean, it's still a great little figure. Uh, I do like him a lot. Um, I think I like Blackjack a little more, and he definitely needs another Autobot symbol <laughs> on his car hood for sure and the problem fixed with the combination but uh, as you can see he transforms really quickly and he's got great articulation for such a small figure so very very nice all the way around just few few minor changes I would have liked to have seen but not a big deal overall but uh there he is and that's going to do it for this review guys i want to thank you so very much for watching as always be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed the video and of course subscribe if you want to see more uh, in the meantime check out my channel i've got way more transformers and combiner wars and all that stuff i just did devastator check that out and uh just look around maybe you'll find something you didn't know you loved in the meantime thanks again for watching i'll see you guys in the next one bye for now